Okay, there's a second video in a series of three videos for teaching the frost is all over. This is a jig in 6-8 time in the key of D. F sharp and C sharp are the sharps, so watch your, watch your second fingers uh, on the A string and the E string. E string will have low second fingers for the G natural, and A string will have a high second finger for the C sharp. D string will also have a high second finger for the F sharp. Okay, here we go. I'm going to uh, I'm going to just break it down really, really simply here. I'm going to do more playing than talking, so you can you can uh, look at your music and follow along, uh, or use your ear. I'll just give you the starting note, notes of the phrases and just just plow right into it. Okay, here we go. Starting note for uh, the A section of the frost is all over is an A. And that's going to jump up to a D. Sounds like this. Good, let's do that one more time together. Ready, in. Remember, uh, on the E, the last note that I played, it's three beats long. It's a dotted quarter note in your music. Make sure you play that uh, for three beats, okay? In your mind, you can count four, five, six, or one, two, three, okay? Uh, here's the next section. This starts with, off with a D major arpeggio, starting on the open D string. Here it is. Ready, in. Great, let's do that again. Here we go. Ready, in. Well done. Okay, we're off to the next part of the tune. Uh, sounds just like the beginning, okay? Without, without the pickup note, without the, uh, uh, without the A pickup. Here we go, starts on a D, little scale going up. Sounds like this. forget to hold that E for three beats. Here it is again. Ready, in. Good, sounding good. And now we're getting to the end of the A section with the first ending. Uh, here it is, starting off with a D major arpeggio, starting on the open D string. Sounds like this. Okay, there we go. We're gonna we're gonna go back to the very beginning now. We're gonna play that through one time slowly. So no no pauses here. We're just gonna go from the beginning to the end of the first section. Here it is. Ready, in. repeats itself uh, and brings us to the the second ending of the A section uh, it's very very similar to the to the um, to the first ending it's only different by one note uh, we go to up to an open E for the last note here's what the second ending sounds like so we have an E there let's do that one more time ready in There it is. And that will take us to the to the third video, uh, which will teach the second part of this tune. Now I should, uh, let, let's just do the whole thing one more time uh, with a repeat this time. We'll play it through slowly, play along. Um, if you're, if you're uh, having any difficult, any difficulty uh, with this piece, rewind, rewind the video and, and go through it again and, and work it out. Okay, here we go. One, Two, one, two.
have it. Go through this video a number of times if you have to. If, you, if you've got it, you can always go to the first video in the set where I play the whole tune through once. If you have to learn the B section of the tune now, go to the third video in the set and you will have this whole tune mastered. Well done.